Hey guys, welcome back to the Purple Dead. Each episode, this changes, I've noticed. But, yeah, welcome back. So, we're gonna continue, and it's gonna be awesome. <laughs> yeah. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. <laughs> I need to get back in the swing of things. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Get so decked in the face. Safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. Thank you. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. I bet. <laughs> Humph. I wish Alvin was here. Yeah, well, he isn't. Alvin would be really proud of you right now. You think so? I hope you're right. I know it's a waste of time. But I can't stop thinking about things I should have All those to were him. good answers. Things I should have talked to him about. Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's going to be a girl. Oh yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. <laughs> I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for did this. Did they boy. reverse? Uh, oh shit. I got this. I know that feeling where you're just like, "Oh yeah, crap, my like baby's I'm not saying I don't trust him, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on him. Got it. Right. I'll be fine. I'll do it. Just like I do. Let's talk to Kenna. Are you okay, Kenny? Sure. Why wouldn't I be? <laughs> Give her the pills. Jane and I found some medicine. Is it safe for Rebecca to take? Hmm. Well, should make her more comfortable anyway. Clementine, you are my favorite person in the entire world. I thought you hated me in the first episode. <laughs> Yay! How are you feeling, Rebecca? Hoping those pills kick in soon. I it was gonna hurt, Clint. But I didn't think it would hurt like this. Well, of course. They say it's like the most painful sensation ever to happen. Yeah, we're going to the museum now. Oh, I forgot about Sarah, kind of. Oh, well. Achievement unlocked history lesson. Hey, Clem. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? We found a place for Rebecca to have the baby. An observation deck with a gift shop. It's way up high and pretty safe from the wind. Oh, that's great. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty-handed. Okay. I just want to help. Okay, I'm gonna look Keep at everything. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I'll watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Jane said these don't work anymore. <laughs> nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> Good point. This sad music, though. Dude can't handle it. You I want. Maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way. Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. No, I sure hope we can find something to take back. Me too. There have sure been some animals through here. 
Watch where you step. Well, is there to look at? Doesn't seem to be much. Oh. Are you lucky? We no. love this not <laughs> so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Everyone's talking at once. Lee love love this place. Hey, shut up! <laughs> but let's give the place a good going over. Okay. There isn't really much else to look at. Oh. That hey, could help. Look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good fun, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Maybe I could give it to Rebecca. That's a good idea. I'm sure she'll really appreciate it. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. Hmm. <laughs> I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully it's fine. Always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best. Oh no! I didn't mean to press that. No. I've got a lot to make up for. Yeah, that's true. Uh, that's not what I meant to say. That's great, but uh, I panicked. The, you know. Uh, we can't put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. <laughs> oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Confederate? That's horrible. Because, you know, it's kind of racist, but I don't know if she would care at this point. We're absolutely going over here. I tell you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the world the way it is now. Where things are now. You're in a, in a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Move box. Oh, queuing it up. Did it. Water. Over here. You guys are horrible at Water. searching that stuff. And clean. That's just what we need. Yeah, but wow, I feel like there's gonna be a problem, like a walker or you something. Kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, but it'd be yeah. really cool. You know, if somebody was small enough, gosh darn it. Maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more. Try the door again. <laughs> I don't know if that'll help much. Are you sure you can't get it open? Okay. No, that's all right. Maybe I can just reach through to the lock. Oh! Jesus Christ! Something got me! That was a bad idea. Hold on! Sorry, Bonnie, I didn't know. Well, I kind of did, but you know. Are you bit? Are you fine, Bonnie? Well, that happened. <laughs> Are you okay, boy? It's just a bump. I'm gonna be all right. I should have tried to crawl through. I might have spotted him better. It's all right. I, I shouldn't have asked anyway. Let me see your arm. No. I... Did you I get, get bite? Bit, just old scars. Okay. I'll trust your word. Something to bring back. <laughs> I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Couldn't Bonnie get the smaller water? I mean, come on. Oh, it's super close. Hey, I got this. You sure? Because Bonnie could have the other one. Thanks. That looks pretty heavy. That's <laughs> uh, alright. I know it looks like a lot. But we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shells were always full. You're right. I thought it looked like so much. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, mm. guys! Oh. Come on, stick close. Stuff is happening. I just Ooh, the raccoon. I'll name him Sylvester or Sly. You can eat raccoon? 
Because, you know. That back, huh? <laughs> Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat. <laughs> I'm I would literally eat the like crap out of that back. raccoon. Yeah. Or I would eat that Shoot, raccoon a lot. I'm not away. sure. Over here. <laughs> Dang it. Not with a I'm naming him Sly. Aww. It's a family. It's probably the mom. Or the dad. I'm even hungrier than I was before. <laughs> How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? <laughs> well, I'm sort of glad it got away. It had a family. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. I would eat the crap out of that raccoon. Okay guys, well this is kind of early, but this seems like a perfect ain't spot for the episode. Sylvester, you know, like Sly Cooper, got away happily, and that was good. But, yeah... I'll see you guys in the next episode. Buh buh. We're gonna run out oh of gosh. Bonds up to the block this gate! Help us! Cannon. We can block the gate with this! I'll help, I'm coming. Cue it up. Cue it up. Do I need to cue it up? <laughs> 